Benjamin. My name is Benjamin. I was born 3rd December 1995. Very nice to meet you, Benjamin. So I was instructed to carry out a neurological examination of the lower limb on you, and that just entailed me to look at your leg and to just see, uh, just ask you to do some action with your leg. Uh, I will explain that in, in more detail as we go along. Do you have any questions for me? Is this going to hurt? No, not at all. Alright. Okay, so ready to get started? Sure. Okay. So could you please lie back on the bed? The patient appears to be alert and well rested with no obvious neurological conditions. And there is no appearance of any walking aids or any other medical paraphernalia around the back. Okay, so I'm going to start observing or inspecting your legs. So, uh, could you just pull your short back a little bit? Thank you. So, there is no scars or any muscle wasting. There is no involuntary movements or fissurations and no pain. So now I'm going to have to assess your walking. So can I have you sit in the other room? So now I'm going to carry out what is called a Romberg test. So can I have you first hold your hands like that, touch them to, the sh to your shoulders, and then can you please stand up for me? Perfect. And then can I have you touch your uh, or bring your two legs together? Great. Now can I have you close your eyes for me? Okay. Okay, ideally I would wait for 30 seconds. That was very good. You can open your eyes. So for prior reception is there. Okay, now can I have you walk to the end there and then just stop when you reach? Just walk normally and okay. put your hands back to normal. Okay, just walk there and just normally, normally. Very good. Now can you stop? And then when you're turning around, I want you to walk so that you're, you're touching your heel to your toes of the other leg. Okay, so like this. Can you do that for me when you go back? Okay, that's excellent. Thank you, Ben. So now I want you to walk over there again, but this time you walk on your heels like this. Right. Perfect, and then you can stop. And when you turn around, I want you to walk on your toes like this. Okay, perfect, thank you. So now we can get back to the other room to continue the examination. Okay, now I'm testing the door. Okay, now it's a place for the plasticity. Okay, now I'm moving on to the bonus. So I'm just going to have you fix a little bit. Thank you. Okay, now I'm going to test for power. So can you lift your right leg up? Perfect. So can you push out against my hand? Good. And I can push down against it. Good. Now lift your left leg up. Can you push out against me? Or can you push down against me? Perfect. Okay. Now can you bend this knee? Okay. So can you push out against me? Great. And then can you push out against me? Perfect. So can you bend your left knee? Can you push out against me? Okay. Can you push out against me? Perfect. Okay, so can you push out against me? Right? And then can you push into your knee? Perfect. Okay. So moving on to the ankle joints. So can you point your feet towards me? Right? And then can you push against my hand? Now for the left one, can you point your feet towards you? And then can you push out against my hand? Great. Alright? So can you point your your big toe? To your head, and then push it down. Okay, thank you. For the next one, go ahead and push it down. Great, thank you. Okay, now moving on to reflexes. So, Can I have you touch the heel of your right foot to your left knee? 
and then run it down your shin, then pull it up, and go again, so touch it to the knee, and then go down your shin, just do it a few more times, as quickly as you can. Perfect. Okay. So now I'm going to do the, uh, I want you to do the same thing, but with the opposite leg, so can you take, take this heel and then run it down the right leg? Perfect. That's it, thank you. Okay, so now I'm testing for sensation. So, when how do you close your eyes? That's a good tip to let the shoulder touch, okay? So when you touch it, when I touch it to your legs, just let me know if you can feel it, okay? Thank you. Ooh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yep. 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 So now uh, I'm going to touch this to the stomach and stand to feel like the right side, okay? Yeah. Okay, so when you feel that on your legs, just let me know that you can feel it. Alright. Okay, perfect. So does it feel equal on both sides? Yeah, sure. Okay, good. Okay, so now I'm testing for proprioception. Alright. Okay, so can I have you close your eyes? Sure. Okay, so this is supposed to feel down. Okay. And this is supposed to be up. Okay. Okay, perfect. So uh, just keep your eyes closed and let me know if you can feel it as up or down. Alright. Down. It's up. Down. Perfect. Down. So now I'm going to test for vibration. Alright. So I'm going to put this on my sternum. Just feel the vibration. Can you feel that? Yeah, I feel that. That's supposed to feel the vibration. And then now that's stop. Okay. Thank you. Okay. okay. So can I have you close your eyes? Please? Can you feel the vibration? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we'll stop. Yeah. Okay. Now for the left foot. Can you feel the vibration? Yeah, I feel it. So now I'm testing for temperature. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna put this to and forth on your stomach. It's supposed to feel cold, okay? Can you feel that? Yeah. Okay. So now I'm gonna do the same thing on your feet. So uh, keep your eyes closed and let me know when you can feel when you can feel it as cold. Okay. Yeah, I feel it. Okay. Yeah, I feel that. Okay. Excellent. So we are done with the examination. Thank you so much for letting me do the examination. So do you have any questions for me or any concerns at all? Uh, no, I can't bother. Today I saw Ben, a 23-year-old male. I performed a lower limb neurological examination, and my exam showed that there is no peripheral stigmata or clinical manifestation for a neurological deficit. To complete my examination, I would also carry out an upper limb neurological exam and a cranial nerve exam.